If you've ever stepped outside on a cold day or watched a spine-tingling scary movie, you've probably experienced goosebumps. But have you ever wondered why we get goosebumps in the first place? Let's find out on today's episode of... Colossal Question. You can call them goosebumps, goose pimples, or goose flesh. They're all the same thing. Little bumps that form on your skin when you're cold or when you experience strong emotions like excitement or fear. They're a reflex, which means that you can't make yourself get them. They just happen automatically. That reflex has a fancy scientific name. It's called the pillowmotor reflex, and it's not just humans who have it. Porcupines and sea otters, for instance, have the same reflex, raising their quills or hairs when they're scared or sense danger. Okay, so we know what causes us to get goosebumps, but why? Why do we have a goosebump reflex, and why does it cause little bumps on our skin? Well, the reason why isn't all that different from our porcupine and sea otter friends. You see, when you're cold or afraid, your brain sends signals to all the muscles in your body, basically saying, alert, alert. That signal causes all your muscles to react by tensing up, and the little teeny tiny muscles in your skin attached to the base of your hairs also tense up, causing them to stand on end. And a little bit of skin around the hair bulges like a flexing muscle. And just like that, your arms are covered in goosebumps. Oh, and you might be wondering, why do we call them goosebumps, pimples, or flesh? Because, well, they look like the skin of a bird whose feathers have been plucked like a goose. Makes sense, right? And now you know why we get goosebumps. Comment below if you have a question you'd like to know the answer to. And don't forget to subscribe for more episodes of... Colossal Questions! Only on DreamWorks TV. 